All right, so as a follow-up to our meeting yesterday, we demoed, uh, created a circuit to demonstrate the basket fill transport system with an intermediate stop using a uh, auto switch that's triggered by a magnet in the actuator to stop a uh, five or three position closed center valve. So to pro in, in lieu of using a PLC, we just did some uh, little relay logic with um, a push button, momentary push button, two control relays, a double solenoid valve, some normally open, normally closed contacts, read switch, and uh, two push buttons. So this is our um, breadboarded actuator. For test simulation purposes, we're using a 25 millimeter, 300 millimeter stroke rodless um, MX series cylinder and a 543 position closed center valve. Um, to sim simulate the full stroke capability, uh, just actually in the cylinder, we're overriding the sensor. I'm going to pan it on the uh, auto switch. Here's the uh, auto switch we're using to trigger the stop from. So I'm going to enable the circuit and uh, we're going to do an intermediate stop. So as you can see, it stops, it hits the sensor and trips the valve here. So we're going to do this again. Bring it home, and, and uh, Dan, if you want to pan it on the sensor, you go a little further back so you can see when I, when I hit that sensor, it stops the cylinder. Comes back. And I'll put this little post in out here just to kind of show the uh, better illustrate the repeatability. in position it's it's pretty strong so it should be plenty for a five pound load and then if you want to get uh, try to get this angle a little further back where you can see the sensor and the cylinder stop at the same time so if you look at get the, see the light hit and that's what's triggering the stop and I think we have it